And to my people, be proud to be a nigga. Don't let the media talk shit to you. And I'm talking to you little got it going on motherfuckers in them little booths. You know who you are. Y'all got some little extra shit so you get the little boofy booths. And a little extra got it going on niggas up front. There ain't nothing wrong with having it going on, but don't forget, be a nigga to the heart. You know what I mean? Because the media tell us, why do you keep using that word? I mean, every other word is nigga this, nigger, nigger, nigger. White people, y'all got it mixed up. We don't say nigger. We say nigga. That's two different words. Let me explain it to my white friends here, because you done hung out at this nigga show, so obviously y'all know what's happening. So I'm going to serve y'all a little info so you don't get fucked up. See, the girl part fucks with us. Nigger. That girl sound like you're growling, sound like a rope around a nigga name. Sound like you're whooping a nigga ass, changing his name. It's just all that old slavery bullshit in the girl. Nigger, oh, you motherfucker. Nigger is a term of love we use amongst ourselves. When I say that's my nigga, I can't give him no more props than that. That's the ultimate when you say somebody is my nigga. That's, uh, I'm jumping in front of bullets. This is my nigga. Get out the fucking way. What's up? We rising together. We falling together. This is my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Nigga. Broken down phonetically, just so you white people know, I'm an educated motherfucker also. <laughs> nigga. Stands for non-immigrants gaining, gathering, achieving. Because we the only people that didn't immigrate to this motherfucking country. Everybody else came by choice. You know what I'm saying? Latino brothers and sisters, y'all chose to come. Well, let's go to America. Go to America. You know what I'm saying? Hey, that's cool. Y'all want to be here, and y'all should be here, because you used to own Texas, California, all this shit. <laughs> Fucked around, got to negotiating with them white folks and lost all that shit. <laughs> Can't trust white people. They'll sign anything. Well, you want the moon? There you go. It's all yours. <laughs> Should have told them, keep your shit, we'll keep ours. That's how that shit work. Right. <laughs> Niggas, we didn't want to be here. Nope. Nigga, we was in the Cuba line. That's what it was originally called before the Italian came over there and discovered it and renamed it Africa. Yeah, uh, right. But it's called the Key Milan. Uh, right. We was chilling in the Key Milan. Who wants to leave Key Milan? <laughs> all the gold, all the diamonds, the best motherfucking weather. The animals there are the best animals on planet Earth. Why? Because you got to go to fucking Africa to get animals to fill your fucking zoos up so you can go and look at us. I mean, who the fuck is going to a zoo to see a buffalo or a deer? But you're going to see a lion, a tiger, an elephant, or all that shit from Africa. Lions just like niggas. They didn't ask to come in. They got a big old frog. Like a nigga too, huh? <laughs> Lying sitting in the cage, man, it's more bullshit. I know that walk. It's the same walk a nigga have in jail. <laughs> we didn't want to leave the leave the richest motherfucking continent on earth. This country right now would fall through the motherfucking economic cracks if it wasn't for South Africa's motherfucking diamonds and gold. Right. Our homeland finances this shit. Right. We built this shit. <laughs> and now that we're done building it, y'all want us to leave. You know those niggers are 
so angry, go home. <laughs> we ain't going no motherfucking way. We got more rights than your monkey ass to this shit. Because if you really gave the contract that they had with us when slavery went down, every slave would get what? 40 acres and a mule. How many niggas are there now? 40 acres and a motherfucking mule, we the own the country. Y'all ain't got no plan to pay us. Your motherfuckers. I wasn't a Christian. <laughs> Discovered America. Man, that's about the biggest bullshit I ever heard in my life. How the fuck you gonna discover some shit a motherfucker already live at? <laughs> that don't even make no damn sense. When they do shit, they come up with words. Discovered. Better known as stole. <laughs> that's what discovers motherfucking damn home in the dictionary. Yeah. It should be discovered. Stealing. <laughs> because if I'm using that motherfucking equation, I'm going to go outside. When I finish this show, I'm going to discover me a car. <laughs> Ain't nobody in it. I discovered it. I don't give a fuck if you in it. I'm going to put a pistol to your head and give you a reservation in the trunk. <laughs> That's what y'all did to the Indians. Oh, fuck it. We gotta have this. Get in the trunk. <laughs> discovered. Ain't that a bitch? We discovered. Let a nigga go to court talking about, nigga, uh, you stole that TV. Nah, I discovered it. <laughs> 25. With an L. I mean, for real. You see the motherfucking dichotomy and the shit that goes on in this country? A nigga steals a TV set, go to court, five years. White man steals a TV set, smack on the wrist, $500 fine. Uh, community service, uh, look, is that your restaurant? Uh, you have to work there. <laughs> Why would he work there? That's what I mean. We're white. We're white, it's all white. You know what I'm saying? But be Asian, Latino, anything else other than white, that's your ass. Am I lying? Yeah. I'm looking at y'all. My two Latino brothers, you know, posing as white folks. It's cool. <laughs> Do your little sneaky shit. Huh? Huh? Oh, Indian. Oh, well, shit. Y'all always been down with us. <laughs> yeah, that's my brother if it never was a brother. Yeah, because when slavery was over, where the fuck you think niggas went? We went and hung out with the Indians on the motherfucking plantation. Had to ask y'all, what's happening around here, man? Yeah, we been picking cotton, nigga. What these white folks up to? Indians like, hey, he who speak with forked tongue. Remember, y'all called that shit a long time ago. He who speak with forked tongue. Meaning that motherfucker say one thing means something totally different. Oh, yeah, you're going to have freedom. <laughs> Freedom to get beat, whipped, <laughs> go to jail. All right, they got the white man shining a flashlight on you. <laughs> like that's the first time. <laughs> Shit, usually the light is bigger, it's on a helicopter. <laughs> I uh, remember them days, nigga. You trying to out run that motherfucker. Be just like the spotlight, nigga. You can't. <laughs> LBC! Long Beach, California. Yeah! Oh, man, you know what I'm saying? Don't matter if you from LBC, CBL. T-W-A It ain't where you're from, it's where you at Yeah I, I want my people to stop claiming hoods We have to You know what I'm saying The world is a whole globe that we sitting on right now We can't think small, man <laughs> Nigga, this is my block <laughs> Man, it's a whole 
whole planet, dog. No, nah, nigga, this is my block. <laughs> Just come with me for a second, dog. Do you own this block? No, nah, but it's my block. Do you own the house you're living in? No, I'm renting. So you dying for a block you don't own and you renting from. Okay, I get it. Hey, all right. You know, anybody should be hollering out, nigga, West Side. Niggas should be the Jews. They own it. West Side, what do you say? West Side. That's my side, hey. because I'm the original Jew. <laughs> All black people in this room are. Matter of fact, everybody in this motherfucking room is Jewish. When you trace your bloodline, all life began in Ethiopia. Yeah. Yeah. On planet Earth. The original Jew. The one the Bible talks about, God's chosen people. Think God chose everybody or just one little group? Wake the fuck up. <laughs> Motherfuckers, they got even my baby brother over there like me. Mm -hmm. <laughs>